today we are reviewing the Cabu Evolution travel pillows. Mm -hmm. We have um, different ones. This is the classic version, and this is their new upgraded S3 version. So I'm gonna have Crystal explain her version first, and then I'll show you the new upgraded one. Yeah, so I got this years ago, uh, probably five years ago now. I was in search for the most comfortable travel pillow because I cannot sleep on the plane without a good travel pillow. And it took me years <laughs> until I found this one. This is the perfect travel pillow for you. If you have trouble, trouble sleeping on the plane like me, this will definitely help you. I swear. Like, it's <laughs> definitely helped me out. It's helped Candy out. It's passed it on to many of my friends and it's helped them out. Yes, it's a little bulky, but the uh, comfort is just, you know, it's like none other. It surpasses all the other travel pillows that I've tried out, that Candy's tried yeah. out. Uh, this definitely is the one that we go to all the time. I actually before, because Crystal had this before me, and before I bought this, because I can't, I couldn't really borrow it and try it. I ordered like five different travel pillows from Amazon. So I love Amazon because you can just return stuff if you don't like it. So I ordered five different ones, and sure enough, that one was my favorite. So I returned the other four and I kept that one. If you want to know the reasons why I didn't like the other ones, we do have a blog post on that, so we'll link it below. But anywho, moving on to But yeah, I yeah. mean the same as Candy and I did try other ones where there was called like a turtle or something, where it's just one-sided and it's plastic, yeah. it's kind of like a wrap around. I mean thing. some people swear by that, but I tried it and I just did I not couldn't like do it. it. I could not do it. There's no comfort in it. Um, yeah, so anyway. Always go back to the Cabo pillow. Um, but yeah, I love this so much because it has all the support that I need. My biggest problem with sleeping on the plane is my neck. So it bobs back and forth and a lot of the travel pillows just don't have enough support for me to actually lean in on it. And so this travel pillow, you know, again, it's a little bit bulky, but it really helps because if I'm leaning to the side, then I don't have to go that much like this with the other travel pillows. This actually supports you. And it supports you really well. It almost looks like it's choking you, but it's not. It's not. But that's, why, at but all. that's why it's so comfortable because there's no yeah. there's no space in between. It's just right there. You don't mm -hmm. have to move your neck at all. Like all the support is there. And the memory foam is great. Yes, yeah. it is great. And um, you know, you can snap it here so that you won't lose it, or you could attach it to your bag. Also, um, the reason why I like this one too was because you could take off the cover, you know, unzip it and wash it because I hate germs. <laughs> I cannot stand it on a plane. Especially when so I, many germs on Yeah, you know, yeah. it's definitely touching all these other germs on your seat. So, you know, I feel gross when I get home. So I'm so glad that you could take this off and wash it. I always wash it. <laughs> Um, and yeah, and then it still stays in shape. It you know comes out like brand new after I wash it. And this one also has a little pocket if you want to put some. I've never actually used this pocket, but I've it's seen, a tiny pocket though. Yeah. Like, I don't know what you would put in there. I've seen people like the pictures yeah. suggest putting a phone in here, but no, I don't think so. I don't think it. I think the no. phone is for the other version. So. Between this one and this one is yeah. another version before this one, and I actually had that version, mm -hmm. and that was the one I reviewed in the blog post that I wrote. Yeah. So it's like, basically that, it had a lot, all the same features, a removable um, case, yeah. we can wash it. It had a pocket, but the pocket was much bigger, yeah. um, so I actually was able to fit my phone in there. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, the, the main difference between that one and the next version was that it came with a travel bag. But it was a very cheap travel bag that I never used it. Yeah, and like, this one did not come with a travel bag. Again, I got this years ago, so I didn't have a travel bag yet. And that was one of my problems with this, because um, I had to kind of make... <laughs> this is the bag I would use, it's, you know, uh, it's called a bagu, but I would just put it in here so that I wouldn't touch everything else, and I would just tie it to my bag. But then this was kind of a problem for me too, because then, um, you know, the flight attendants would think I would have three bags, but I actually oh, didn't, yeah. you know? So then I was like, okay, fine, I'll just put this on and, you know, ride on. But yeah, with... and the main reason why you don't, you want it in a bag is when it's going through security, because you have to put it yeah, on Yeah, it's the, just, it's touching and everything. It's, and I've heard that is the most, there's like so many germs on that. Yeah. So I just, yeah, I So I not. had to protect it <laughs> Anyway. So, with my travel pillow, it's, um, it's an actually an upgrade from, the one that's in between, <laughs> that's not here. So I actually had a, um, an upgraded version of this. 
and when I was going to Japan last year, I was, you know, I had it on my suitcase. And because the bag sucked on that <laughs> travel pillow, I really hated the bag that they provided for it. It was like this really cheap um, plastic bag and it didn't snap on or anything. So I just had it kind of lightly tied around my suitcase. And when I was getting out of the car, it fell off into the car. Luckily it fell into the car, but I didn't realize that it had you know, fallen off my suitcase until I was way past security. And I was like, no, <laughs> because I was going from LAX to um, Tokyo and I did not want to be on that long haul flight without a travel pillow. Yeah. So luckily, um, when I went to one of these stores inside the airport, Kabu was there and, and they had an upgraded version from what I had. And the upgraded features were amazing. One, the bag was way better. Um, it, the bag is like this, it's circular, and look, it's got a nice snap-on. Nice snap this is exactly what I wanted um, in the travel pillow bag. Mm -hmm. And another upgraded feature that wasn't on the other um, pillow or on this one mm -hmm. is the Velcro strap. Yeah. So this is a really cool feature. I wouldn't even think of, I mean, I never even thought about it when I was I don't know, when you're flying, and it's just, right. I don't even know how they came up with it, <laughs> but yeah. if you notice like on your seat, there was like this little like attached headrest. And so what you do is you, and this is, since this is adjustable, cause all air, cause I've used this on a few airlines now, and every airline has like, the size is a little bit mm. different. So you basically attach this to your headrest, and that way when you're sleeping, even if you move, it keeps you in place. Because mm -hmm. there are times when like all of a sudden, like when I'm sleeping, like my head would really tilt low and it kind of like wakes me up. Mm -hmm. But when this is strapped to your seat or your pillow, it really keeps you in place. So like I really sleep well with, yeah. the, um, with the Velcro attached to the back of my headrest. And another great thing about having this is if you have to get up to go to the bathroom, um, you just kind of slip out of it and it stays attached to your chair. Because I know there's been plenty of times where I don't like wearing this to the bathroom. Like I'll put it on my seat and then it falls down or yeah, something. That's definitely happened to me. Yeah. And it's like, oh no, not on the floor. I know because you put this around you and you're just like, oh, I don't know what kind of germs are on it now. <laughs> so, um, so yeah. So definitely that the belt, the adjustable strap, Velcro strap that goes to the um, headrest attachment on the airline seats is a really really good mm -hmm. um, feature. And it's really cool too, like on the side here, there is a pocket to stick your uh, travel bag, travel pillow bag into, so you don't lose this. That's another thing too, is like, I'm sure you will easily lose this if you don't um, store it right away after you take it out. Yeah. So I highly recommend using this little pouch and storing it. Um, and then when you get off your flight, it's really easy uh, to stick it back in here and there's even like a little mesh pouch here. I mean, I don't use it, but I guess if you want to store extra things, you can. Um, I, at first I was like, I don't even know if this is going to fit in here. Yeah. <laughs> it looks tricky and they have instructions and you know what it was? It was so simple. You just roll it. <laughs> <laughs> you just roll it up. Just roll, roll, roll. Just roll. Roll it up. And it just goes right in and put it in the bag. <laughs> and that's how you do it. <laughs> step one, step two. Yeah. And, I mean, mm -hmm. it's fairly easy. Yeah. It's definitely a, better than the other bag that yeah. I just did not like, so. Yeah. That's it. There and you then go. I just put it on my suitcase like <laughs> but yeah, I when I saw this, when Candy had this, I was like, I need to get one now. <laughs> so um, we just went to London and uh, before we went to the airport, I was like, no, I'm going to get that pillow today because I'm sick of not having a bag for my pillow. That was my main <laughs> sell because again, I hate carrying this thing around because, you know, it doesn't have a proper attachment. It's not even, you know, I mean, it fits, but then it looks like another bag. So you have three bags instead of two. So then the flight attendants will call it out, which I hate it. So then, you know, I would just have to wear it around me when I board and I didn't like doing that either. So this bag was a huge sell for me. Uh, so right when I went to the airport, I went to go look for one and I found it. So I got an all black Kabu upgraded pillow and it was worth every single penny because <laughs> I had my bag. <laughs> because I don't know if you know this, but 
it is super hard to find a travel pillow bag. I looked everywhere for it for about a year and I couldn't find, not even on Amazon. Amazon didn't even have it and I found, I find everything on Amazon. <laughs> they didn't even have it. I looked on Kaboo, they did have one. Oh, but I didn't know they like, sell like separate travel they pillows. They did, oh. um, but they were sold out hmm. and they've been sold out. So I don't even know if they ever restocked, but I just could not find one. Anyway, found that, or I saw Candy have it, and I just had to go buy it because I was just sick of not having a bag. That was yeah. like one thing because I hate having germs on my pillow. Yeah, I don't like it either. Yeah. I'm so glad these are removable as well mm -hmm. because, yeah, I, I hate having a dirty pillow, especially on, it's so dirty on flights. <laughs> like, yeah. I've always heard it's like, it's really dirty. Right. Um, I did want to mention like the price points right, right. are a little bit different. Like this one obviously does cost more than the mm -hmm. classic one. So mm -hmm. if this one is not in your price range and you don't really care about the bag or you, you don't necessarily want the straps, I mean this is still a great travel pillow because the structure is still the same. Yeah, like, it still feels the same, yeah. it still works the same, um, you know it just has the upgraded feature of these straps and it comes with a bag. bag. So um, I think, and they're both still on, I mean, they're both on Amazon. Mm -hmm. um, we, I just happened to get mine at the travel store and at the airport because I needed one right away. But you can buy them, you know, you can go to Kaboo's site or on Amazon, so. Yeah, so it's about a, like a $10, $20 difference. It depends yeah. on when you buy it. Sometimes the, this upgraded version has a discount, which right now they do. I think it does moment. right now. Cause yeah, I think on Amazon, sometimes they sell for $49.99. I think right now it's $39.99. Mm -hmm. And I think that one's $29.99, something yeah. like that. Around that range. Yeah, around that range. But yeah, I mean, depending on your budget or what you, what you if you like the added, you know, upgraded features, you know, yeah, they're both they're both great pillows. Yeah, they really are. I mean, Candy always rests so well with these pillows. Like, <laughs> I do too. Like, I cannot uh, go on a plane, especially a long haul flight, without these travel pillows. Candy, whenever we're traveling together, she is just knocked out in like five seconds. And she's like on her laptop for like hours. Mm -hmm. I I can't even watch the movies half the time. I like fall asleep. So yeah. <laughs> so Candy always comfortably sleeps right away with this travel pillow. Yeah, I have a routine when I get on my flights like. Well, the long haul flights, I put on my travel socks, I put this on my seat, I put on my blanket and my nice coat, and bye bye. I'm out. I turn bye -bye. on, yeah, I turn on the movie, and then I'm out like halfway through it. <laughs> so, yeah, I do a lot of things before I fall asleep, but if I fall asleep, I need this pillow. I cannot sleep without it. We hope you liked our review. Again, these are, you know, depending on which one you get, I don't think you're gonna be disappointed on either one. They're great travel pillows. We're not even sponsored by them. We just love their pillows so much. I just absolutely <laughs> love it. I recommend this to everybody. I recommend it to Candy. I recommend it to all my friends. Yeah. I just, I really swear by this. It's such a good travel pillow. Thank you, Kevin. We love your pillows. Love it. <laughs> uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to watch more of our videos, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.